Let's talk understanding spiritual success. And thankfully, through today's funnery devotional by Apostle Grace Lubega, we are going to understand it way deeper. So the theme scripture is 1 Corinthians chapter 11, verses 1 in the King James Version. And it says, Be ye followers of me, even as I also am of Christ. It goes on to say, There is a spiritual explanation for every circumstance that happens in the physical realm. Sometimes we look at this truth from the perspective of failure, pain, and suffering. However, it also applies to the positive aspects of life. A man's success is not explained by looking at his material possessions, the size of his business, or the reach of his ministry. There is a spiritual explanation to his success because any success starts from the realm of the spirit before it is manifested in the physical realm. This is the essence of imitations. There are people who admire the success of others and because they desire to walk in those same shoes, they set their hearts on imitating the wrong things. How the man dresses, the car he drives, or how he speaks. That is imitating what is in the physical realm. Impartation is possible when we imitate what is spiritual as opposed to what is physical. You must ask yourself, what are those things that a successful man has done that resonate in the realm of the spirit? How has he laid claim to spiritual territories? How did he distinguish his spiritual sound? In asking spiritual questions, you understand spiritual success before you explain its physical realities or results. Further study Hebrews 13.7 and Hebrews 11.3. Golden nugget. There is a spiritual explanation for every circumstance that happens in the physical realm. In asking spiritual questions, you understand spiritual success before you even explain its physical results. Prayer. My Lord, I thank you for this word. This knowledge gives me an understanding of how the world works. I look to the spirit because I know therein is the source of many things. With this wisdom, I live a consistently victorious life. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for allowing me share that with you. And hopefully, I'll see you again next time. Bye.